yesterday I was at the Winter Wonder Festival 2013. And uh, yeah, it was very busy, very crowded. The end of this short introduction video will be the slideshow. Uh, I apologize in advance for the goofy transitions and slideshow quality, but that's what I, you know, that's what I give. I give the least amount of effort. Anyhow, uh, what did I pick up? Not too much this time, but uh, enough to be satisfied. Uh, first and foremost, um, water slide decals that are very appropriate for the QB day, especially the binders. Uh, I picked up two of them, uh, the butterfly decals, and uh, I think they look quite nice on the binders of a cube day. Anyways, um, I picked up those two. I think they were 400 yen each. Actually, I can't remember. Maybe 400 yen. And while I was on the uh, subject of stickers and things of that nature. I got myself some giant Gundam stickers. Yay. And of course, Xeon. I guess I should have gotten the Neo Xeon. That would have made more sense, but I don't know. I like these better. More of an iconic look to them. No idea what I plan to use with them, but uh, I don't know. I'll find something to do with them. Maybe put it on my um, uh, desktop or something of that nature. I don't know, but I've got them and that's fine. I think that was 400 yen uh, as well. Um, and the final thing I purchased is actually, you know, what the Wonderfest is all about, which is a um, resin kit. Now, you're thinking, it's not Cuba Day and it's not Haman. What the heck are you doing? Well, <laughs> I was sort of sold because of the price tag. Now, 2000 is quite cheap for any resin kit. Uh, however, this was towards the end of the show, and this guy was doing a one-coin sale, uh, basically 500 yen. So I picked this up for 500 yen, and uh, to tell you the truth, I don't even know this girl's name. I'm pretty sure she's from the um, Commander Frog or Keto, Keto P. Or, I, actually, you know, honestly, I don't remember. Uh, Keto Yeah, there you go, Keto um, but, yeah, uh, what am I going to do with her? Well, I was impressed with the size of her. She's quite large, actually, uh, and for 500 yen, you can't go wrong with the price. Uh, let's see if I can make that Uh, I was thinking maybe I can actually mod her. I've never modded, you know, just a resin kit that doesn't have any articulation. Uh, I figure it'd be easier than an articulated, um, kit, so, uh, it's quite large, you can see. Um, so I was thinking maybe I can mod her into a Cubidae girl, perhaps? I've got a lot of, like, extra Cubidae stuff, so putting on some binders on the shoulders, maybe, uh, something, you know, the, the funnel pack in the back, and that should be about an, enough just to make her sort of remotely like a Cubidae, and she's already sort of color-based, and I can adjust the colors, uh, to more appropriate Cubidae colors. And I've got, of course, the, uh, water slide decals, so everything seems... Like I'm ready for it. Um, it wasn't really an intention. I just couldn't pass up 500 yen. Uh, anyhow, uh, that's that's it. That's all I picked up. So uh, next will be I don't know maybe nine or ten minutes of slideshow. And yet again, I'm sorry for the uh, <laughs> the presentation value of it. Uh, but that's just the way it is. Take care. Peace out and enjoy the slideshow.